elbow feel after that? Feels good, you know. Um, there's a lot of pitches, but I felt good. I felt, you know, good all night and a lot of adrenaline. So you don't really feel those things, but it felt great. And, you know, the team backed me up really well. So the adrenaline tick up when they come out and check you for substances like that? Or? Definitely. Um, you know, I was trying to keep it under wraps a little bit. I, I taunted them a little bit, but, you know, I was trying <laughs> to keep it ni nice and easy. But um, overall, of course, something like that, you know, it's going to fire up the crowd. It's going to fire me up, fire up the bench. And so that's just kind of a, a perfect storm. And, you know, maybe one of the worst things they could have done in that moment. <laughs> What, what did you kind of say? I saw you on something in the dugout when he headed back that meeting after that substance check. I'm um, just kind of asking him where, where's the where's the sticky at? Um, just you know, I, if anything, you know, it's it's a, it's a compliment from them. Of you know, my, my stuff is feeling good tonight, and it's 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 almost a compliment. So you know, not, nothing nothing wrong with that. You know, a little gamesmanship from them, but you know, I felt good and. Um, I'm going to take that as, you know, uh, you know what if, what if I did use sticky stuff, you know, then, then that's a little extra. So um, it's, it's, it's good to see that, that people respect that and, you know, feel good out there. Was the pitch count about right for you, a little, little high? I, I mean, you, you say you felt all right, but that's the most you've done. Yeah, that was the most in the season. Um, arm felt great. Door came out to the mound and he was like, you want him? You want this guy? And I said, yes, I, I, I really do. I got him right here. And so, you know, a few extra pitches, but I executed them and arm felt good. So... I guess that's all you can ask. I, 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 my freshman year at junior college, I threw a lot. Um, I've thrown a lot more pitches than that in an outing. So um, it is my most for this year, but, you know, it's it's really nothing new for me. So it was good. Have you ever been checked like that before? I have not. So yeah. that, that was the first time. So yeah. I guess I was, I was responding in the moment to it, but it was good. Yeah. And it was noticeable, your an, not just in that moment, but each inning there for a move forward. I mean, you became more animated. Yeah. I, is that a byproduct of the game or the check or all of the above? I think all of the above. Yeah. You know, when you're in a, an environment like that and the crowd's getting into a little bit more every yeah. inning and um, you're feeling good. I, I think I struck more more guys out in the back half of the game too, so that kind of amplified it a little bit. And um, I think just the, the entire game, uh, the, the environment kind of played into all that. It seemed like that slider in on their hands was going really well. What what was generally working best tonight? You know, everything. Um, it's it, it's a rare outing when you get everything working, but it's it's special when it all comes together. And so um, I, I really wanted this, especially after last weekend. I felt like I didn't execute as well as I could have, um, and so I really came out. And I I, pre I prepped a lot for them. Um, and I just, you know, I had all the confidence in the world and, you know, I bounced back well and that's that's all I can ask for. Uh, and seeing Bridger come in and, and deliver after a tough week, how would you describe what he did and, and how did you kind of support him through, through last week? You know, uh, everyone's going to give up runs. Yeah. Like, obviously, <laughs> he had a zero URA for so long and, um, you know, that that's just not sustainable and so um, to see him bounce back after, after something uh, like that is just awesome and, you know, Everyone has the same faith in Bridger, whether he gives up you know, runs or no runs or, or whatever. I mean, he's just awesome. He's, he's the best closer in the country, and you really can't ask for more from a guy. So he's he's been awesome, and I'm sure that he's going to continue to be. I know you and him, you and Bridger jab each other. Who's got the better slider? Who did tonight? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I guess I threw it more, so there's a bigger sample size. But I'll go with me. Um, you know, I'll probably I'll probably never give him the edge, even if it is better. But you know, just just fun back and forth from us. But yeah, any Was there part of you? Point did, that you felt locked in? Did you have a good, uh, you know, bullpen session before the game? Was it early in the game? Was there a moment where you're like, I I'm dealing tonight? Um, I try not to think about that too much. I yeah. kind of just t try to take it pitch to pitch. Sure. I think, like, for me personally, um, when I think a lot, when I think, you know, in whether it's in the game or before the game or whatever, um, I generally do worse. And mm -hmm. so the, the less I can think, the more I can just go out and execute every pitch and, and you know, try to be in the moment is, is as best as possible. So, so what are you thinking about then? <laughs> when you're trying not to think? Not thinking. I don't know. I just, Daily I guess, TV on? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's kind of just, just doing more than thinking. Yeah, yeah. Um, and, I guess I was I was good at that tonight. So, were you and Mitch and uh, and Doors ear at all trying to get back out for the ninth, or were you ready to grab a seat? Um, you know, I I was at 114 pitches, and so I kind of knew the the writing on the wall. And going out for the eighth, even Doors like you've got a you got a short leash, um, and so you know I kind of knew. Um, and you know I wanted the ninth, but in, in the grand scheme of things, I got faith in the bullpen, and you know. Uh, it's, it's probably for the best that I, I didn't just because that was, you know, 20 more pitches than I've thrown all year. Your elbow so, thanks you. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so um, I'll probably wake up tomorrow and be like, yeah, I'm glad I didn't go out for the night. But, Is there you know. something extra about playing the Ducks and being a part of this series for the first time and having that type of performance that you mean a little more because of that? Definitely. I mean, uh, the rivalry, the history and everything is, is big and it plays into it. And, you know, to have Goss as animated as they were and um, just hearing them and, 
um, the, the passion that they have, especially for this rivalry series, is, is, is great. And obviously going into this weekend, um, it's a big matchup for us, especially bouncing back from last week. And so we've got a little extra fire from that, a little extra fire from fans, and you know, just a little fire overall just because we're playing Oregon. Um, and then me personally, last year I, I pitched against them in, in the Pac-12 tournament when I was at Arizona, and, and they beat us, and um, I didn't have the, the best start, I guess. Um, and so this is kind of a redemption in, in that regard, but mostly just you know just going out there and playing for the fans and playing for our team. Previous career high in K's was here last year, wasn't it? Yes, sir. Yeah, so I thought, yeah. So. I know there's not a ton of guys left from that Oregon team last year, but obviously Walsh, Bruce Smith. Does it have, how much do you carry over from last year in, into this one? Um, you know, a, a couple of those guys, you know, it's they 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 came back, but they've also changed a lot as a hitter, and I've changed a lot as a pitcher. And so generally, you know, I, I, I take that into account, but a year's a long time. And so I was just trying to execute my plan that I have for, for today. Uh, and, you know, just, just letting them do do what they're going to do because, you know, a lot of guys change in, in that long of a time frame.